I loved the way that the orchestra actually mingled with the patients. So they were straight in there, introducing themselves, showing them the instruments, and they'd bought a lovely bag of um, little wooden wipeable instruments as well, so all the patients were able to sort of shake the maracas and uh, bang the tambourine, so they were really able to participate. For our patients living with dementia, and music is so important because it engages every lobe of the brain, it enhances relationships with the you know the team on the ward and their fellow peers on the ward as well so it's it's magic when it just kind of you know everyone gets involved <laughs> of our job that we just feel really really lucky to be able to do which I know can sound really like cheesy but um, watching the reactions of the patients and the staff is, is just very humbling and we feel very very fortunate that we get to come and for the sake of playing a few tunes together cause such a, an effect and the music they chose was mm. just just resonated with them because it was of their era you know a bit of Moon River and a little bit of Beatles and it was just fabulous just again music for people with dementia really does just it, Mm. You know, it gives them a, a quality of life and uh, it just, you know, improves their day when they're stuck in hospital, you know, for sometimes for months our patients are on the ward. So, yeah, it's really made a difference to their day. Well, we think, again, it's one of the important values we have is that you have to remember that they're people first and that when we come into this environment, we're not coming in like, oh, I'm a musician to perform a piece. We're coming in to meet people and to make relationships and, and music has a way of making you have a relationship immediately. 